Hey folks, this is Cal again. This is a video that describes how when you connect and disconnect the vacuum hose to your fuel pressure regulator, how it affects your mixture. So there's been a bit of confusion about what this, how this actually works and what this test is meant to show you is that when you disconnect it, it reaches up and when you connect vacuum to it, it leans out. And the reason for this is vacuum applied down here to the back of the regulator pulls the, the diaphragm and therefore the spring up. If the spring comes up, more fuel escapes back to the fuel tank, therefore reducing the pressure in the fuel rail. I've got my laptop over here, winning a power commander with auto tune. I have my air fuel ratio readings there ready to go when I start the bike. What I'm going to do is put the camera now in my left hand. A little bit dodgy when I, as I do this. Alright. Now I'm going to start the bike and I'm going to plug and unplug this vacuum hose, if you can see it down here, which is just how long at the moment. I'll be pulling it off and on to show you how the ratios go. So I'll start the bike, wait for the O2 sensor to heat up, and then we'll do it. Just going to zoom in a bit. Okay, you can see it says 9.99 because the O2 sensor is cold. When the O2 sensor warms up, I'm going to reach down with my right hand, pull the vacuum hose. Alright, when I pull this hose, it'll spike for a second until I can get my finger on the vacuum hose, right? Okay, it's going to spike for a second. Alright. Check that out. The vacuum hose is off. 12.3. Alright, I set a spike, I have my finger off the hose of the spike, I plug it back in. Alright, it's plugged in. 13. I'm gonna take it off. 12.5, 12.4, 12 12.2. .4, 12 okay, I'm gonna put it back on. Wait for it. Back on. You may even hear the slight change in the engine note. 12.8, 12.9, 13. Take it off. Dropping, 12.2. As the engine heats up and the revs drop, it'll drop down below below 12. I'm gonna put it back on now. So it's spike for a second. Okay, you see it goes up. The spikes, by the way, are caused by when I take my the hose off just see this, where are we? when I take the hose off uh, it takes me a second or two to get my finger on that and in between that time the engine's sucking in uh, excess air um, other than what the map sensor is reading so it affects the mixture obviously leans it out some so that's, that explains that but basically that uh, that is evidence right there that when you you know Disconnect that, you get a richer mixture. Plug it back in, you get it lean. So I can assume that my pressure regulator is somewhat working.